tools by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial I'm just going to show you how you can create a diamond symbol, diamond path. Now it's a very basic diamond path, of course you could add other paths, you can colour it in thousands of different ways. Now this is the basic way I do it, so I'm just going to quickly go to rectangle tool and I'm just going to drag a rectangle out. I'm using the shift key, now hold it, make it a basic square and then what you can do, just rotate it I'm just going to rotate it around 45 degrees and then just go to the direct selection tool and I'm just going to drag it up, hold the shift down again so you can drag it up there. Now I could actually do the bottom half as well, just select that and then drag and then hold the shift down and you've got a basic diamond shape. Okay, so once you've done that, I'm actually just going to quickly resize the whole thing so I just resize that down I don't want it that size now what I can do then you can obviously add a fill and I'm just going to add that but I'm just going to actually have it just with just a stroke so I'm just going to add that and I'm going to change that to one of the width profiles and I'm going to make it a bit bigger than that so now there's the diamond design basic very basic diamond design now to make it a symbol there's the symbols palette over there now if you can't see it, window and symbols, just there, and then just select and just drag over there, click OK. Now you can add the symbols numerous ways, you just simply drag them over, again like that for an instance, and also what you can do, you can just go over here to the symbol sprayer, and what you can do, you can just apply them very rapidly across an image, an artboard. So you've got a nice diamond design. Now you can modify the diamond design as well, diamond symbol. You can shift it or scrunch it, size it, make it bigger or hold smaller by holding the alt. So you can reduce it down so you can see them shrinking away. And you can fill the document with a whole range of different diamond designs. Now just remove those all in one go and you can drag the diamond over and then you can, of course, duplicate it, hold the alts down, move that over there, right there. So you can create literally thousands of different diamond designs. Now you can also, of course, drag that over there, click OK, you've got diamond design there. Right, hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.